Well, there's some controversy over flags in Hamburg. Town leaders and high school students raised the pride flag at Town Hall. This was Friday. The town supervisor says a flag that honors prisoners of war and those missing in action was taken down because it was tattered the same day. But a local vet believed the flag was being permanently replaced. He was arrested after he got into an argument with the supervisor. And today I spoke with another vet and the town supervisor who put the flag up while we were there. Why did that flag come down, the POW flag? As we lowered the flag for the ceremony for the pride flag raising this past Friday, the flag was noted to be tattered and torn. And we made the decision that it should be removed and replaced. Hamburg Town Supervisor Randy Hoke says a pride ceremony outside Town Hall Friday ended with a confrontation and arrest. This after one veteran expressed anger over the removal of the POW MIA flag in raising of the pride flag. We had uh, uh, some kids from Hamburg High School actually raise the flag themselves. So after the conclusion of the ceremony, folks were standing around uh, socializing when we were suddenly approached. There's a veteran here uh, for the pride celebration uh, who stood up uh, to say something to the individual. And uh, once she did that, he turned around to approach her and I got between the two of them. Was there anything derogatory said about the raising of the pride flag? There were some very derogatory comments. And you've been getting threats. How many calls have you been getting emails? We got about a dozen calls at the office today. Uh, there, was, there was another group who had publicized my personal cell phone number on social media. This is the flag that was taken down. And Monday, while we were in Hamburg, a new one was delivered. So Friday, the POW flag came down because it was tattered. Today, on Monday, a new one's gone up. Absolutely. And, you know, it always surprises me the uh, impact that the weather in the Buffalo area has on these flags. I spoke with veteran Russell J. DeVizo, who says they're planning a rally in support of veterans. The vet who was arrested, there, what happened between him and the town supervisor? Well, it, it, the confrontation was over the uh, POW MIA flag being taken down and in its place, the pride flag. We don't have any problem with the pride flag or anything like that, as long as it's displayed properly. Is there any way that this could come to a peaceful resolution? Put the flag up and leave it up the way it's supposed to be. It's up right now. Well, that's good then. As you watch this go up, all three flags will now be flying. What, what are you thinking about? That while I believe that all three of these flags stand for inclusion, well, Deviso tells me that they are planning a rally for this Saturday at 10.30 a.m. It's being organized by the Constitutional Coalition of New York State. The town supervisor will be hosting a pride ride that same day at 11.30 at Woodview Park in the village of Hamburg.